Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Rule the Waves as the United States episode number 16 and we're in part 3 of this fleet battle. Uh, we managed to more or less sink uh, 3 of the big ships that we've seen. I'm just by memory thinking that we have one battlecruiser pretty much down. We have one battleship and then one dreadnought that's limping. We have one battlecruiser and one dreadnought which are still on the loose. Luckily for us so far we've only lost small ships, destroyers mainly. So we'll see how everything else goes. Uh, let's jump into the episode. Otherwise this devastation should be sinking now. Still not. Just taking a walloping. And because I don't, I really don't want this Levosier to survive, I have to keep going this way. Okay, let's see. So that, that turn looked like it worked out pretty well for us. This is the one that's sinking. Okay, who, who hit her? Lightning? Okay, yeah. Cornier class. I really wish we had identified this. I don't think it's an armored cruiser. Pretty sure it's a light cruiser. Doubtable, devastation. And that's... I'm hoping to see more of that. Okay, she's swinging our way. We're going to go ahead and reverse uh, targeting priorities. Looks like the Saratoga stupidly launched her torpedo at the Redoubtable. Unforgivable in my opinion. We'll bring the Devastation down hopefully with that torpedo. And then we got to prepare already for <laughs> this battlecruiser coming in. No torpedoes. So I think what we're going to end up doing is yeah, just gunning down everything but this devastation. If we don't, if we don't end up getting any torpedo hits on her, we'll leave her just for the lightning to take take care of mano a mano. It's a little risky because lightning. I mean, it's already taking some damage. Gosh, it's tough. That makes me reconsider yet again. It would be really nice if we had any destroyers with torpedoes at this point who could just swim up and land a hit on the Devastation. We're going to have to rely, unfortunately, on our light cruisers for that. Okay, the alligator. Should we just guess that she's going to make her turn to the east eventually? I want to keep hitting this armored cruiser for, I mean, this light cruiser. I'm pretty sure it's light cruiser. I want to keep hitting her first. And you know what? Yeah. Oh gosh, it's really hard. Let's get everyone to focus on here and then we'll maybe we can draw this battle cruiser into the fight. Nice. That looks like it's gonna hit or did did not. It's about as perfectly as you can go through the middle of a ship, but uh unfortunately probably ran deep or something. That's alright. Pretty confident this ship is going to be destroyed. Two more light cruisers. Two more hits on light cruiser. Wrong light cruiser. Darn it. Saratoga getting some hits on, uh, getting some hits being hit. Alligator near miss. Okay. Okay, so let's see. Levosier. Redoubtable. Devastation. Two on light cruisers. Three more devastation. Levosier, yes, very good. We do have this Levosier, and she is not sinking yet, but she's not even much of a threat with four-inch guns. So we'll turn... Oh, you might have port sides back pretty quickly. No. No, not at all. No. Well, in this... In this way, yeah, we will get the alligator to turn because we already have the this light cruiser group division uh, accomplishing the task which is desired, which is to keep this devastation pinned from moving further east. Now, can you target this new out of arc? Okay. Close then. Saratoga, do you have any torpedoes left? Two, yeah, so those will both be on 
the other side. Very surprised that didn't hit, by the way. <laughs> we'll come back and, you know what, this is what the Palatka could make her way over to do, is sink this Devastation. How's she doing? Oh, down to zero flooding. Actually, she's... Let's get her up to cruise speed and send her on over. One hit on the Pertusiani. Maybe the Mary can help with that as well. Who knows? Okay, looks good. Philippines was hit by a torpedo. Let's find out. They're all devo avoiding torpedoes. wonder where these torpedoes are coming from. One. Okay, Philippines had two torpedoes launched her. And maybe this Cornier class? I'm just surprised any of these ships have any torpedoes left, but where else could it have come from? Still raking the Devastation. She should be going down. I'm surprised she hasn't. Interesting. Oh, good. Fired her. I'm glad we're not able to fire two torpedoes because I don't think that's even going to be the right firing solution, but... And you have one starboard. Well, might as well come back and try to swing it on the Devastation. And yeah, I guess... Huh. Six inch hit, so three hits on the Devastation, one on one four inch hit on this Battlecruiser. Uh, the shots on the... Shots on the, on the Redoubtable just make me ill. Uh, Le Bossier, she's probably a goner. What is their armor? Why are these things so tough? Two and a half. Maybe that's why. So like I say, Pertusiani, another hit. Good. Session and Aurora. Okay, well, let's just keep going. I'm not really sure. Ooh. Alligator, if you turn tight enough, we can actually get in a broad, uh, a, another torpedo. So. Oh, wow. So... The Tennessee is actually targeting the correct ship. It's amazing. Okay, so the Cornier is getting hit. By the way, Philippines, minor damage. Okay, good. Devastation getting hit by 14-inch guns. That's fantastic. More Cornier hits. That's four 6-inch guns on a 900-ton ship. Okay. These light cruiser, this light cruiser, I'm pretty sure, is going down. So this is useless. Oh, and a fifth six-inch gun. Okay, redoubtable hits, which are yeah, obviously useless. Devastation over here. Still isn't going down, but looks like Saratoga's launching on her own. This Dunkirk appears to be in good shape. Oh, these ships are so weak. Oh my gosh, even our light cruisers have a chance of doing some real damage. Uh, Le Vossier over here takes another hit. Still ticking. Devastation takes another hit. And Salt Lake City takes a few hits, redoubtable, and another hit, which is silly. Okay, well, that's interesting. It's really hard for me to figure out the best solution here. I think I'm going to chase down this Devastation, and it'll be worth more points. Wow. 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 Eight 14 inch hits from the Tennessee, just obliterating the Devastation. And we even hit this Dunkirk with okay, well, four inch guns, that's not going to do the trick. Uh, Galveston's actually going to be in very bad position here in a moment. Somebody save her, please. Well, if they continue this way, they are going to move into our Dreadnought line. In fact, I'm going to pull off, I'm actually going to go for the Battlecruiser. I think all this damage is going to be enough. I'm hoping that it's like an, this many hits. And please tell me. Uh, that would 
have been the best. I would have overrode it if I was the captain. I would have just told him to launch anyway. Yeah, okay. Oh, man, it's tough, it's tough. Got to make decisions, though. Okay, let's send the lightning back this way, and the Tennessees will go back after the battle cruise. That's what we're going to do. I was waffling on that for a little while, but that's, we finally really made our decision. That's a terrible torpedo, Aurora. Do not fire at the wrong ship. Galveston, you have... You could. Let's do it, just in case. We can always get this Devastation. She's not sinking, but her rear guns are down. Let's get you to speed up a little bit more, just to get you out of the way. And yeah, let's, let's prepare for a drive-by on the Dunkirk. While well, the Lightning is going to have to chase over the Devastation. Not as many hits now that we turned. Dunkirk, Lavoisier, Cogne, Lavoisier. Yeah, only one hit, which is a six inch one. Not going to do that much, really. We have the Warrington, who can hopefully keep them pinned over there. Okay, let's do that. Oh, wow. Guess the Voice here just got raked. She is turning up, so that's going to help us. She's turning up into our dreadnoughts. I had a ship, by the way, at some point who was deploying smoke. Maybe I turned it off. Maybe it was this one. Who knows? <laughs> Alligator's just trying to navigate through the, the field of rotting corpses, basically. This one sunk. That one's still going. How we do down here, by the way? Looks like uh, Ebenezer Hor can slow down to 10 and make another pass at this transport. Palaka's slowly making her way back in as well. She could be the one that takes out that Devastation that we've been worried about for so long. Ah, uh, wow, well, that's... Probably doesn't matter. She's probably going to sink. We'll get her to go down to eight. Just, you know, we'll try to save her. And uh, somebody pointed out, by the way, that um, a lot of the ships that we have here, since this is not a, a sea zone where we have a port, although we did have patrol ships from the East Coast arrive here, so maybe we can somehow use that port, <laughs> that um, they, we might have a lot of these ships interned. And I'm... Yeah, I think that's actually still an acceptable decision because, first of all, we got it. I, I want to do it for a fleet battle anyway. I'm not going to turn down a fleet battle um, just because I know I'm going to win. I'm going to, well, I presume I should say that I'm going to win in a big way in points. So, and but it's also really exciting. I mean, this is the point of the series is to demonstrate battles. So yeah, I, I mean, I could decline the action, but it, it, that would be pretty boring. By who? Oh man. They're still kicking down here. Uh, this is just not ideal. That we have to head them off with our ship. <laughs> okay, Lightning, get ready. You're going to be in very soon. So we'll definitely want to be targeting this Dunkirk class. Okay, so let's see what happens now. Galveston, by the way, do you have any torpedoes? You don't. Yeah, we'll just keep hovering nearby. Okay. Your rudder's broken anyway, but we'll do our best to come back in. Okay, let's do this. Yeah, that doesn't really matter. That was already going down. But I'm seeing a lot of hits. I'm seeing a lot of hits that I like. 
four inch shells are not going to do much, but the six inch shells maybe at this range might, I don't know. Well, high explosive, we can do superficial damage. And the Dunkirk, one, two, uh, what, just one 14 inch hit, bunch of six inch hits, and then one 14 inch hit on this Lavoisier from the Philippines. That's not terrible. I mean, we do want to sink these other, oh, okay, she's sinking now, good. And now Lightning, your job, your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to target a ship which is currently out, outside of your visibility. Okay, fine. What's your speed right now? 16 out of 24, let's get that engine turning, giddy up. And that's looking good. Six inch guns, four inch, six inch. Okay, two 14 inch, one, two, three, four 14 inch. That's what I was expecting. We already knocked out her uh, her port side, side main gun turret. <laughs> Wing, that's the word. So this will probably be over pretty quick, in which case we'll have to switch back to the Devastation. We have fire in the middle of the ocean. That could really happen. So this is kind of bizarre, huh? The Devastation refuses to yield. <laughs> we were really trying to head her off. Alligator is taking a view. It's, I was wondering how she was doing. Vosier just got blasted again. She's down for the count for sure. Yeah, you know what? These ships, when they're finished here, are going to go help the alligator. I'd like the alligator to survive. It looks like this Kanye is still intact. Yeah, and the Plotka is actually going to get back into the battle. It's a miracle. Okay, wow. So the Dunkirk just took... This might be a... Might be a game-ending barrage for her. We don't really need to be hitting that ship, but... We knocked out another gun. Very light armor, very low tonnage. Yeah. Okay, so what happened here? This ship is actually on fire. We did it. After enough hits, <laughs> the ship is finally on fire. So let's see what happened in the actual fray. Salt, the Salt Lake City's taking a few hits. Um, New Jersey's taking some hits. And then... Four six inch guns, no, three six inch, one four inch on the Devastation. Some more hits on the Devastation with four inch guns, and somehow, eventually, all these ships managed to light this one on fire, which is great. Obviously, that's really going to give the Lightning a chance to catch up. Lightning, how are you doing as far as ammunition goes? I might want you to conserve ammunition here. Yeah, the Devastation, that is exactly what you want to be targeting. And let's get that speed up if we can, huh? 16 still. We'll get the, these light cruisers to help out here. That's what we'll do. And the Palaka, this poor Devastation probably thinks like, oh, I finally made it. I'm going to limp out of here. Unfortunately for, unfortunately for her, she isn't going to make it. We hit the Redoubtable with another torpedo. Wow. That's really not what I wanted to do. Okay, so the Dunkirk has just taken... Yeah, she's on fire. Just... She's dead. She is dead. Let's turn and see if we can hunt down this... This is just a weird situation. I tell you. We're going to turn away. We've done enough. We're taking hits. We don't need to take any more. Let's get out of here. Lightning will finish the job. First of all, it'll be easy to track her since she's on fire. Yeah, and this Dunkirk is not going to make it. Already on fire has just taken so many hits. Okay, let's see what happens here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Rudder jam starboard. Oh, God. No. Salt Lake City. Ramming speed. Damn the torpedoes. Full speed ahead. 
wasn't how I was uh, hoping that would go down, but that will mm, force that ship to come to a stop. Okay, this freeing class has been doing pretty good. Nah, yeah, not, not amazing. Well, there's another 50-whatever-minute episode, so I'm going to call it here. We didn't really need to drag this one out as much as I did, so I apologize for that. But I'm going to wrap it up. And what will... You know what? Actually, shoot. At this point, I'm probably too late in the episode. We'll have to make this the... the uh, I'll have to go back and edit in so we don't have too many 50-minute episodes. So yeah, let's just truck on, and I'll split this up somewhere in the middle. Let's just keep going. I think we know what's going to happen here. This one's going down... The bell, uh, that's look. That looks good. Salt Lake City fire extinguished. That's good. She actually drove through, managed to survive. That's good. Um, probably we should do some detaching here, just to get my New Jersey able to pull off in some direction. Um, yeah, so now the Platka, she should be targeting, yes, that is the one. Let her line up her broadside and go to work. Yeah, I mean, we've done a lot of damage to this, just Dreadnought, even with 6-inch guns, I think. I wonder, are, um, is smoke obstructing the field now? Wrong thing. No, not yet. We haven't been going long enough to have smoke hampering everyone's vision. Three knots, it's going down. Okay. Just pour back through these then. Yeah, this one is she finally sinking? No, it says not. We hit one more time. We're hitting on the Konya class. Devastation took another hit. Oh, good. The placa is opening up. Hey, very, very, very good. Fantastic. Okay, steady as she goes, Platka. We'll even keep you at 16 just to make sure we don't open up any of uh, those damaged bulkheads. Lightning's still in charge of chasing down this Devastation. I think she'll be able to get to it. Let's turn you off AI control. Get you out of here. Okay. Unidentified ship is getting just decimated. Just decimated still. Galveston's launching torpedoes at what? Redoubtable? <laughs> it's still going after that redoubtable. Let's get the placard to launch her torpedoes now that I remember. Not a big deal. I think that at this point, the guns are going to do the work, but yeah. Gattable took a hit. It's silly. Okay. Lightning chasing down the Devastation on this basically is what the rest of this uh, mission is going to come down to. And we do have a light cruiser swimming around over here, I saw. Still doing some work. That Pascal's dead. So let's go after this Lavoisier, which is, no, that one's also dead. So the Freant. Yeah, let's go after this Freant then. You might survive? No. <laughs> no, almost no chance in hell. Yeah, no torpedoes. Does the New Jersey have any? Probably not. Four minutes until she gets the starboard, though. That's, well, probably not wor worth losing her. Okay, so Devastation is still taking... Oh, this is the other Devastation. And it looks like that one's a good hit. And Pascal takes a hit. She's already sinking. Things are starting to quiet down. Okay, Devastation hit by a torpedo. Is that finally it? That is! It is the end of her. Okay, good. But that's all the Palatica was here to do, is just make sure these ships are all sinking. So we'll just drive her right through the middle of these, make sure that other Battlecruiser's sinking too. She's the, she's the cleanup crew. Take her down to 12 to even be more safe. Kind of what the Ebenezer Horror is here for as well. Is this a sinking ship? Maybe not. 
tattered remains of the French fleet are probably all fleeing at this point. The Bossier was hit by a torpedo, not the one we care about, one that was already sinking. Yeah, so let's pursue. Flat goes on cleanup duty and the rest are in pursuit. We'll be moving to fresh air too. Lightning, how are you doing? Let's see if you can get her. Oh, we did actually land some hits. Okay, so four inch guns, six inch guns. And then the rest are on the other. Okay, and then the Pascal's just getting decimated again. That's old news, not important. Let's keep this up as high as we can go. What's your speed now? You're up to 20. Okay. You will catch her then. Black is still devastating. Lightning! Oh, there it is. 14 inch hit. Okay, good. So we should be reeling her in. Galveston's launching torpedoes at what? Oh, God. That's, that's rather silly. You might hit the alligator, but thank you for launching torpedoes at a ship which is 100% going to sink. So it all comes down to the lightning now. Can she finish her off? The Tennessean crew probably aren't going to be able to catch up. Ah, there goes the Salt Lake City. Lightning is taking some hits. Maybe she's not cut out for this. Lightning! Oh, wow. Responded to my taunt. The six 14-inch shell broadside landing out of 12. Pretty good accuracy. Must have really, I mean, I'm just imagining the, <laughs> a broadside where half the shells are hitting and half splashing all around. That's, that's pretty great. 23, They're about evenly uh, matched in terms of tonnage. And the lightning is outclassed in terms of uh, armor, but then of course she has the speed. The important thing is if, if we can just slow her down We'll be able to get close enough with our other, with our other ships. So, we'll make sure that one's dead. Everything's dead here. We're catching up to this light cruiser, which we'll also try to take down. And uh, ships are just going to start going in any, any direction they want now. Patterson spots another ship. Okay, well, hey, you know what? Let's go finish this one off. Oh, that one is already sinking. Well, that is a new one. Okay, Devastation is probably... Oh! The Lightning's Torpedo? From long distance? It can't... It's not the Lightning's... <laughs> Her starboard torpedo is not launched. The New Jer... The New Jersey! From long distance. Wow, what a shot, New Jersey. My goodness. One hell of a shot. Well, congratulations to New Jersey. We're going to credit you with this kill. Not that the... <laughs> we'll have to give a lot of credit to the, the Dreadnoughts for doing the initial huge 14-inch shell damage. Good. Good. I, I don't even have to look over here anymore. We know what's going to happen. So, she's going down. Try to even keep pace with uh, this one. Yeah. So now it's over. Uh, I mean, she's even turning, sinking on fire. It's all over. And here comes the dreadnoughts into range. Lightning will probably try to speed on with these other light cruisers and see if we can get catch this other armored cruiser. Or the Freant is even a, a fine uh, ship to try to bag at this point. Bring her down. Don't need to worry about her. And the Plaka is now... Uh, yeah, th I, I knew there was one ship still swinging, swimming around over here. And a light cruiser, huh? Quite a few of them, I guess. So Plaka will just have to <laughs> push them away. Wow, 
Wow, free in class getting drilled by our... Oh, yeah, yeah, by our, our pair over here. Thought she already reported heavy damage. Well, she's missing turrets now. I mean, yeah, this is not looking good for her. Lightning can come down and really finish that off completely. Yeah, that's... It's not just the beginning of the end, it's the ending of the end. Lightning hit by a torpedo. She might go down. <laughs> Incredible. Did not see that one coming, I'll tell you that much. Oh, she's going to be okay. But we'll pull her off. We will pull her off. Definitely going to be the end of that one. And this one's already going down. I think the Plotica probably... Swing her back down one more time. Oh, we did find this ship. That's nice. Looks like the alligator regained control. We were chasing a ship over here. I don't know where she went, so we'll just pull them back. Yeah, there's still one more ship here. It looks like Ebenezer Horror isn't done yet, huh? Got one more mission. It's a desperate destroyer, I'm telling you. Got a few more hits on her, which is good. Okay, so that should be the end of the battle. Just going to kind of let it finish out. I'm just going to rack up the kills. <laughs> just keep torpedoing all these ships. Oh, we spotted one. Yeah, that's the destroyer. I guess she, she didn't make it. And I think we can just speed this up. And things will come to a close. Fan up to all corners of the earth. This is not what I planned, but it's just the way I'm ending the, the battle. Okay. Wow, that's actually a lot of time. We still have a lot of time left, turns out. The lightning sights an unknown ship? <laughs> okay, it's a sinking ship, though. <laughs> I was like, this is inc Wait, it's not. Huh. Who would have thought? Well, let's bring everyone back. I think the lightning can still take care of her herself. So I'm not too worried about this. I, I can even pursue that ship if I really want. Twenty percent fuel remaining. There's someone. Oh, it's a Freant. I really thought this battle was over, but you know, it's one little Freant trying to make a, trying to give us some work. A New Jersey, you're forty percent, probably not in great shape.
Do we get a hit or something? It looks like she slowed down a lot. Yeah, one 14 inch hit. Might have been all we needed to, to seal the deal. Yeah. Yeah, she's a goner. Get the New Jersey to finish her off. We didn't want it to be that way, but uh, you know what? They just they couldn't, couldn't get them to stay away from us. We'll leave them alone so we can once again speed up to ultra fast. Very good. There it is. Okay, so in the end, total victory. One light cruiser, seven destroyers lost. I have always been. Uh, you know, the destroyer fleet in my under Admiral Tortuga does not have a, a particularly long lifespan. It's kind of like reminds me of submarines, submarine crew, or or the bomber crews in World War II. But the results are very, very powerful, very clear, evident that this tactic is working. So two, two, one. If you worry about us going to get intern or not, well, there's nothing that can happen worse than having your ship sunk. So obviously this was a, a fantastic result. Yeah, we're gonna have some weird. Duplication of the screen, I can see. <laughs> Let's uh, do it this way. Whoops. There we go. So 24,000 victory points. This is definitely worth acknowledging as a... Yeah. And it looks like... Well, we'll get the report um, eventually about whether or not those ships are going to need to be interned or not. You, you, we'll get the news when they come back. So we'll try to get all the ships there, every single one to return. Any ship in Northern Europe should return to the East Coast. Okay. And even the ones that are there, probably we'll try to move these as well. It won't work, but I don't know why. I just wanted to try it anyway. Uh, it looks like we'll probably have the Ebenezer Whore, the Lightning, and the Flatka interned. But the ones with only one month will probably end up surviving. And you know, the funny thing is we even blockaded them this turn as well. But uh, anyways, that's going to wrap this episode up, which is now the end of episode 16. So thanks for watching. And until the next episode, take care.